Grazie. Crede? A scuola? Namoro? Travalo? Facoltà? Termino? Amigo. Amigos. Diploma? Promoção? Aceitação? Trabalho? Promoção? Trabalho? Promoção? Trabalho? Expandir? Trabalho? Expandir? Trabalho? Expandir? Governar? Dominação? Supremacia? I have this theory that Pedro Pascal is maybe the easiest person to draw on the planet. I drew a square and then started adding facial features. <laughs> now it looks like he's going, hmm. Best Daddy Ashy introductions. So you want people to notice your drawings. Just add ass and tits. I love pissing off the neckbeard incel anime community. So let Daddy Ashy pry open your jaws and force fuck you in the throat with an What's worse than having your breeding sausage mutilated by your ex while you're tied down? Looking at better drawings than yours is the same as watching your dad plow your girlfriend more effectively than you. <laughs> hey there, Mickey. I haven't seen you since you walked in on Minnie giving me the business at the clubhouse. Ho oh, ho, shut up you pestilent dog. I'll neuter your ass. Away, away. No! Do not! Okay, you ready? Here you go. <laughs> Do you want to know how to draw a flower? Here, let Daddy Ashy force open that fudge cavern and fill it to the brim with some warm, salty drawing tips. First, start off with a massive stem. Three inches is more than enough. <laughs> right, girls? Go ahead and start adding the flower petals. It's kind of like the labia of the flower if you will. This is gonna be a rose just to remind you that you will never find love. Next, take some colored pencils and fill in the ink lines. By the way, if you're a man, the first and only flowers you will receive will be at your funeral. I guess if you're an ugly woman, that applies too. Anyways, I gotta go study for my prostate exam. I'm sure I'll post again sometime this month. I'm gay. One time I blew a mall Santa. Drink well. Bye-bye. Dr drink well? Okay, it's time, it's can't be no old girl, drop it like the NASDAQ. Move white girls like this coat of my ass crack. Move black girls, cause man, fuck it, I'll do either. I love pussy, I love bitches, dude, I should be running Peter in Adidas with some short shorts. B O O all over me, my green is where it's supposed to be, your green is in my grocery. Mr. Bean. Alright, you guys ready? <laughs> Here you go! <laughs> What's up you musty little stinker? Here's some art things that give me earth-shattering erections. Number one. It's a little controversial, but lime lips are probably my favorite reoccurring drawing. In fact, every time I see these, I excrete Nickelodeon slime from my breeding shaft because I'm just too damn excited to contain myself. Number two. Pendulum paintings. These require a ton of skill and hard work. I often try to pee in my toilet in a similar pattern out of respect for the craft. Some of these paintings are for sale for more than it costs to adopt an actual child in the US. So I tried to achieve the same look with a marker. This will be available on my website for $9,011. Number three. The most panty moistening art thing on earth are TikTok artists forcing satire to try to farm views because they're ultimately running out of ideas.
I am sitting in a cat tree in the house where I am living. I am waiting at the counter for the man to give me breakfast. And he doesn't seem to notice that I'm hanging in the kitchen. Need to get his attention so he knows that I am hungry. Meow, 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 meow. Hey, Dane. Yeah? I want you to draw a monkey stripper. Oh. Done. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it in a cage? Because it growled at me. It don't squeal and remember that it's all in your head. I feel like I would have to go bald if I had this many eyes. Anyway, you're the 16th, I think, uh, page of this, so you could nominate someone else to be in it. You could not keep track in a staring contest. Jump Street, and we're about to jump in your ass. Mm -hmm. Right in the crack. What's more important, weed or us? Weed. Man, he didn't even think about it. <laughs> if you go, I'll stay. I'm just gonna get it out of the way now. So you're the 22nd page, so you can nominate someone else to be in it. This will be the only page with someone making this face. Mike, you gotta stop with this jaywalking! Miss me with that gay shit. What gay shit the law? Now open up your eyes, you see the world that is red. Now what's the word, Captain? Maybe. Alright, I did it because I just wanted to see what this three eye thing would look like. Also, people commenting on this video, no, I'm not gonna draw you. You, 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 you're not gonna shoot a puppy, are you, Jack? Yeah, in the face. Why? Hmm. Good question. How about I leave you alone with this guy instead? I will rule the world. All hail Biden! All hail Biden! Uh, just another day. Gonna move my car. Oh, what's this? We buy jump. Oh man, what's wrong with my car? What's eight minus four? Eight. Well, no. How, how'd you get that? Because you have eight up there, and you take away a four, so it's not there anymore, and you, and you eight left. My art before art school? Boo. Bad. That is bad art. Not cool. So not in. I hate it. My art after art school. Yummy. Mommy, look. I drew a stick man in school today. Huh? That doesn't look like a stick man. Oh, I forgot the eyes. Let me draw it. Hmm, it just looks like the letters O, G, and C to me. No, no, look! You have to look at him sideways. He's holding a wand. Fellas, I need to tell you something. I think I'm homosexual, and also I'm addicted to cocaine. <laughs> Calling all underrated artists. Use this sound to show off your best piece, your second best piece, and your third best piece. A baby in the womb, and instead of an umbilical cord, it's got a vape. The very hungry caterpillar logging his calories on my fitness pal. A family of four walking a drone as though it were a dog. An ice cream man, but instead of giving the kids ice cream, he's giving them Prozac. An iPhone wearing a wedding ring. One of those signs they have in theatres that tell you when to clap, but instead of applaud, it says disobey. A woman cleaning a house, but the stuff she's rubbing onto the wall is just black, greasy petrol. A firefighter strikes a match. An adult man is in a pram. The pram's being pushed by Tony Blair. A CCTV camera, but when they look up at it, 
It's just a mirror. A monkey with a 50 pound note. Do you want your parents to love you more than your siblings so you can get the inheritance when they die? I'm sure they'd love you a little more if you knew how to draw a sick ass dragon. So Ricky here is pretty lonely just like you, so we're gonna go ahead and give him a dragon. So for step one, we're gonna go ahead and draw the head, because who doesn't love head? I recommend using a reference image, so I used a lion's head for the reference here. Um, and to Leo Weeb's comment, I would just like to say that you have been in a coma for two years, and I don't know if you can hear me or what kind of life you're living in your head, but you need to wake up. This is the last time I can talk to you before your family pulls the life support. Please wake up, we miss you. Um, but yeah, for step two, you're pretty much just gonna wanna finish the drawing. So yeah, here's the end product. Do you derive sexual pleasure from public humiliation? Because my followers do. Roasting your art part two. Here we have Theodore Roosevelt standing. If you're a history buff, then you know that his legs were floppier than grandma's coochie salami in the wind. <laughs> Which means he probably had to sit to pee. What a pussy, right guys? Next we have a glass of either whiskey or piss. Either way, I'm okay with it sliding down my greasy fucking throat. This submitter, quote, might have schizophrenia, but hasn't been diagnosed yet. Speaking of schizoid drawings, here's my boyfriend Carter's drawings. 100% schizophrenic, 1000% boner inducing. To be featured, DM me pics of your drawings and or your ass. Okay, teacher in the class draws this shape on a board and she says to the class, what shape's that? Little Emily puts her hand up and she says it's a rectangle. So she says, well done Emily, you come up and draw something to go with that shape. So Emily goes like this. I've turned that into a barn with a door. Well done, she says. Who else would like to have a go? Little Charlie at the back puts his hand up, but she ignores him because she thinks he's going to be rude. So little Sarah comes up and she says, well, I went on holiday to Iceland, so I'm going to draw snow on the roof. I drew some lovely snow on the roof. Who else wants to have a go? Charlie's wetting himself at this point, but she still ignores him. So Sam comes up and he says, well, I went on holiday to Florida, so I'm going to draw lovely sunshine to melt all that horrid snow away. So she says, who else wants to have a go? Charlie puts his hand up and he thinks, she thinks, okay, maybe he's going to draw a fence, a tree, maybe some birds, some clouds. So go on then, Charlie. So he comes up and he goes, well, if I go like this, miss, That's my granddad picking up a bar of soap in